Thank you for joining for the webinar on sharing assignments to the student portal. This uh, won't be very long, but after you create your assignment, you're going to check mark the box in front of your assignment. And also when you're, I'll show you another way, but I'm going to go up here and student portal. And this is where you're going to set all of your parameters. You're going to choose your class. So I'll choose my earth science. You see I've already got celebrity. This is where I'm going to choose the day and then set the time. So this is only visible to the student portal for my earth science period three class at whatever parameters I put. Of course, then I can hit remove to remove that as well. Then while available, you have some choices here. If you want to show graded score, you show your responses, show responses and incorrect answers. And then, of course, again, you have those choices. And then down here, documents. If you attach a test, then you can choose to show and allow download, show documents, or hide documents. And then after expiration, again, you have choices, the same choices. So once you set your parameters and you hit save, then that assignment is going to be, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't choose. It's giving me ouchie because I didn't choose. Let's do December 6th until December 13th. Then hit my save. So now when that's when your students log in to Earth Science Period 3, they will see the um, Nescape 2015 practice. I can also, when I'm in the assignment and I'm in my key, I'm able to show student portal here. So I can go right to my student portal there and also choose my assignments. Now, if I have an attachment or a test, this is where I'm going to upload. It has to be a PDF file. So I'll go and choose a PDF file and then attach that. So then when the students log into the student portal, they're going to see that attachment there as well. And I can do that back here when I'm choosing my assignment. Then I can do, and I can do the student portal. And then also then you are able to choose your different parameters again. One more area, when I'm in my assignment, I can also go up here, manage attachments, student portal options. So you have your three your your choices there as well. If you have any questions on how to share assignments and attach, again, the attachments have to be PDF files. And then there will also be a webinar on what the students are able to see on their student portal after it's been shared. Please uh, send your questions to support at greatcam.com or you can call me at 866-472-3339 and I'm extension 703 or option 3. Have a great day.